As the station inspector, we have the great Sasha Baron Cohen. Seems Maximilian doesn't like the cut of your jib, little man. Well, Sasha, we knew that Sasha was going to bring some craziness to that role. He was really feeling that he wanted to be in the running for certain serious uh, accolades, so to speak. For this role, I decided to put on three stone. He was very thin, and he insisted on gaining the weight. Oh, he calls it stone or something. I wanted to create the effect of triple chin, which I felt in the 3D would be quite powerful. He ate uh, three times a day, four times a day. At first, he had fun with it. Then it became an obligation. One thing I had learned at the Royal Shakespeare Company was to ignore all direction, particularly from anyone under six foot tall. He would never listen. He never listened. In fact, if he did listen, I wouldn't know. The first thing I did was I took my script to Marty's trailer, and in front of him, I ripped it up, really ripped it up, and said, this is what I think of your script. And I said, listen, if you think I'm going to say this, you're wrong, and I'm willing to fight you about it. And I brought a knife with me, so he had no chance. I've never seen someone show up, and every time a director asked them to do something, they wouldn't do it. They would do the opposite. And that's what he did. I said, listen, I'm going to say whatever I want in any order, and you'll make it work, because I want this done in a couple of weeks. And Marty would post, he asked him to do something that he knew he didn't want to do, but I didn't know that. And I'd go, well, that doesn't sound right. And Marty said, just wait, because he'll do the opposite. And I would shout action and cut on set, much to his consternation, but I didn't care. I said, Marty. When I'm acting, I shout action and cut. And he was very angry, particularly when I started shouting it on the other people's scenes. When you see him, you're thinking sort of, wow, yeah, I don't know how this guy could play the station inspector. Before I started this production, I had been told, do not work with children. And having done this production, I can honestly say, I never will again. They are incredibly annoying. They're immature, and they have a very pungent aroma. There were three dogs in the movie that I've acted alongside. Wonderful actors, tremendous method, all of them deep, deep, deep in their characters' names and voices, barking, resonating the dogs from the 30s. I would like to direct this movie. I think Martin is doing an awful job at it. He's clearly inexperienced, he has no idea what he's doing, Nobody wants to see a film about a child winding some clocks. So at every juncture, I'm trying to put in some sauciness, something to spice it up. He kept on saying, I'm the director, let me direct, it's my story, blah, 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 blah. So I gave him a couple of takes, and they can do the rest with CGI or double. I'm off to the south of France.